Two teams vying for a European spot met on Friday for the opening game of Ligue 1's 27th day as Montpellier welcomed Rennes to La Mousson. Both teams came into the weekend on 41 points with Montpellier 6th and Rennes 7th. The champions have made a bright start to 2013, taking 15 points from a possible 21, and they're unbeaten at home since October, though they did start this game without the suspended Eunice Belhanda and the injured Remy Cabela. Ren, on the other hand, were held to a draw at home by Socha last week and have only claimed one win in their last five league and outings. After a quiet opening half hour, there was a chance for Ren in the 33rd minute as Julien Ferré scooped forward for Mevlut Erding, who fired into the side netting. A superb ball forward from Ferre and Erding not far off. Then on the stroke of half-time, Daniel Congre crossed into the Rennes area and Anthony Mounier attempted an impressive bicycle kick. The former Nice man getting close to getting the better of Benoit Costil here. Goalless at the break then, with the state of the pitch doing neither side any favours. Just before the hour mark, Ren came close again as Roman Donze headed into the path of Ferre and a fine first time strike here, but a little bit too high to trouble Geoffrey Jordan. Then in the 75th minute, Marco Estrada whipped in a free kick for Montpellier. Benoit Costil could only punch as far as Jonas Martin, whose shot was blocked, but Vitorino Hilton pounced on the loose ball to make it 1 0. Delight on the Montpellier bench, with Costil failing to deal with the ball across here. Montpellier captain Hilton taking full advantage. Costil did claim he was fouled, but he appears to have been impeded as much by his own captain, Danze, as by Hilton. Montpellier even added gloss to the scoreline with the second goal four minutes from time, and a fine one it was too. Suleiman Kamara skipped forward and picked his spot beautifully, thrashing the ball past Costil for 2-0. Well, Costil was not to make a single save in this game, but still conceded two goals, even if, as the replay shows, Kamara handled the ball just before recovering possession. Senegalese forward nevertheless claiming his eighth goal of the season in fine style. 2-0, the final score at La Mosson.